crash in southwest Miami-Dade. We are now learning that this is connected to a missing persons case from over the weekend. Let's bring in Local 10's Trent Kelly. He joins us live with more on what happened there. So, J.C. Eric, we know the victim in this case has been identified as a 20-year-old FIU college student. His car found submerged in a retention pond not too far away from the FIU campus. That student initially reported missing over the weekend with his loved ones holding on to hope that he would be found alive. That hope, though, quickly fading late yesterday. A submerged car spotted in this southwest Miami-Dade retention pond on Monday. The discovery causing police and FHP troopers to close off the nearby entrance ramp to the Florida Turnpike at Southwest 8th Street. Divers arriving a short time later, finding the body of 20-year-old Nick Ruiz inside the waterlogged vehicle. The FIU civil engineering student first reported missing over the weekend. Detectives say Ruiz was leaving a house in South Miami around 1.30 Sunday morning and was heading to his own home in Hialeah, but never made it. Investigators later issuing a bolo or be on the lookout with Ruiz's picture and photos of his white car. His friends telling the one and only they spent several days retracing his route before stumbling upon the police scene Monday night. Ruiz's white car pulled from the water, his body still inside, those close to him looking on in shock as they remember the life of the student who they knew so well. And as of this morning, investigators tell us it does appear as though this crash was accidental. They believe Ruiz lost control of his vehicle while he was negotiating a curve on that turnpike on ramp. For now, that is the very latest live from Southwest Miami Day this morning. I'm Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.